Hello, thanks for checking out our Indiegogo page for our new film, Flowers in December. My name's JT Molnar, I'm the writer director. And I'm Chris Ivansevic, I'm the producer. Uh, JT and I have made three films together and mm. they were fortunate not to win multiple awards and even get distribution deals. And so we've decided to go out and do another short film project. And we've got a really hard-hitting, fantastic script. We've got an all-star cast, but none of this can become a reality without your help. I really never thought I was going to make another short film. Um, we've done three of them, and we're moving on to the feature world soon. But I felt compelled. I wrote this script. I was inspired to write this script. Um, I wrote it for Dee Wallace because I've always wanted to see her in a different kind of character than she's played before. I've been waiting to see Dee Wallace in this role, in this crazy against type character for years now. Um, we're also working with uh, uh, the great J.D. Blanc. He's been in, uh, recently he was in uh, Breaking Bad, which I'm sure you've heard of. Uh, also he played um, Luigi Vampa in uh, Count of Monte Cristo. Uh, we're also working with Robert Craighead, who's been in countless TV shows. And, um, he's really the right guy for the role. Um, he was recommended highly by Dee, and uh, I got them together, and, and they've got a lot of heat between them, I think. I think he's, uh, they're gonna have a lot of chemistry on the screen. Uh, we're also working with Gabrielle Stone. Gabrielle Stone did, I believe, her first ever acting role with me on, on our, our, my second short film, Henry John and the Little Bug, and she played five characters in the same movie. So I know she has what it takes. This movie is compact. It has a hard hitting, hitting ending. Um, it's honest, and I feel like I'd like to revisit what I like to call the blue collar drama, something that was really big in the 70s with movies like Tender Mercies and uh, Urban Cowboy and um, Five Easy Pieces. More, more recently, maybe The Wrestler could be categorized as that. We're gonna make a movie that's, that's, that's dirty and real and passionate, a movie about love, but most importantly, I really wanted to make a short film that was designed for the form. I know for a fact that, and I've known for a little while, that if I go back and I can make one more short film, I can do it right. And although I know I can't make a perfect film, um, I truly believe I can get close to perfection on this one. And that's why I want to make it Flowers in December. Our goal is to make a cinema-ready film, uh, just like a film you'd see when you go to the movie theater. It's tough to do, and that's why we need your help. You know, JT and I are going to be putting our own money into the film, but we need help to cover the additional costs of making a truly quality movie-going film. A film that's actually going to hold up to the standard of acting that we're having with these world-class actors. You know, things for production, post-production, and then at the end to promote the film at film festivals. So and we're, you guys we're shooting on it. film stock. Like we're actually, real film stock. We are actually shooting on film stock and we're not going digital. So that's, that's an added cost, but it's definitely going to be something that's going to show up on screen and you're going to really, really notice. It's going to be beautiful. I want to thank you, and Chris wants to thank you from the bottom of our hearts for checking out our page and being willing to put in your hard-earned cash to uh, help us make our dream come true. Yeah, really. Thank you so much. When this film's on the big screen, you guys are going to be so excited if you were a part of it. And uh, we really want to share that moment with you, so thank you. Thanks again. See you at the opening.